two, two, three, three. I'm on ten again. Yeah, state your name. What is going on guys and welcome to another video and in today's video I am going to be going over why you are not losing weight Okay, and I'm afraid the answer is very simple. You are not in a calorie deficit You are eating more calories than you are burning or you're equaling equal to okay That is the overall determining reason why you are not losing weight end of okay You're not in a calorie deficit some of the common mistakes which I see why people ruin their calorie deficit are you're not weighing your food you're not putting your bowl on a pair of scales and pouring your cereal in cereal in we are not good as humans at eyeballing the weight of food okay I'm gonna do another video on this but even me who's weighed my food for the last few years I cannot eyeball accurately okay you might think oh it's only 50 calories but 50 calories a day for five days, that's 350 calories. Do that over uh, do that over a month, that's 1,400 calories in a month, that's half a pound of fat. There's half your deficit ruined, okay? Weigh your foods. Next, you need to move more. There's two ways that we can create a calorie deficit. We can either eat less or we can move more. If we do both, we create an even bigger deficit, okay? So get out and make sure that you're hitting 8, 10, 12,000 steps a day. Make sure that you're parking a little bit further away from work and walking in. Make sure that you're using the stairs. Just be as active as you can throughout the day. These little things add up massively. Next, simple. You're cheating on your diet. You wouldn't cheat on your boyfriend or girlfriend, so don't cheat on your diet, okay? You get what you put in, all right? You wouldn't expect to cheat in a relationship and the relationship to work, so don't expect to cheat on your diet and expect your diet to work, okay? That's it, simple. Make sure that you are logging every single little thing, okay? That moves me on to the last point, is the little things that we aren't logging, okay? Some of the common mistakes which I see with people is olive oil, cooking with olive oil, a tablespoon of olive oil is like 150 calories, okay? Do that once or twice a day, that's 300 calories a day, times by a week, it's a lot of calories. By a month, by two months, by three months, by six months. You can see how these little things add up. Tomato ketchup and things like that, not logging that into your MyFitnessPal. Milks and teas and coffees and, oh, I've got a, a little chocolate here. Oh, it's only 80 calories. But you do that a couple of times a week, it all adds up. All these little things seem like very, very small things, but when we put them all together, they all of a sudden, they mean we end up like this. We're trying to create a deficit. If you're not weighing your foods, if you're not logging everything, you're cheating on your diet, you're not moving enough, we end up just here. We end up at our maintenance, or you may even be gaining weight. So it comes down to you being objective and asking yourself, are you being accurate with everything, okay? It's all about accuracy and consistency, okay? If you do those two things, you will get results, okay? Have a look at these things and try and incorporate some of them into your diet and training and see if they then help you get the results, okay? Let me know how it goes, guys. If you guys have got any other ideas about content that you would like to see, please leave something in the comments below or DM me. If you've got any questions, send me a DM. Also, please like and subscribe and I will see you in the next video. Two, two, three, three, I'm on 10 again. Yeah, state your name.